Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm glad to see you all here and thanks for watching. Today uh, I decided to talk about the transportation uh, system in Halifax, like what to expect, uh, what kind of transportation uh, do we have and let's get started. Why I decided to shoot this episode? Uh, mainly because when I was immigrating to Nova Scotia, I, I was just not thinking about like transportation or there are many buses or trams or whatever it is. But when I uh, arrived uh, in Halifax, uh, this uh, question was really important as I need to commute, right? I need to commute to the bank or uh, I need to go to my groceries and uh, so on. So that's why I decided to give you some um, basic understanding like what Halifax can offer you and in general in Nova Scotia how you can commute. So first of all uh, let's start from the buses because I think this is the only transport you can um, have in in Halifax or in uh, Nova Scotia. Um, the buses fare, uh, if we're talking about Halifax, uh, is uh, 275, but you can also buy a bus pass uh, for the month, so it will be cheaper if you're using the bus every day. So it will co cost you around like 90, 100 dollars, something like that. You can buy a pack of tickets. It usually um, it's very strange for me, but you can buy tickets only in the store, like Sobeys, uh, like drugstore, like uh, Shoppers or Lotus Drug. For me, it was like very weird, like why I can buy like in kiosk or some other uh, station, but no, you can't buy even on the bus station uh, because there is not a bus station itself. Just few but really small and with no people inside. Uh, what else I would recommend you is uh, when you're entering the bus you are giving a bus driver a ticket. It's really really small and uh, you can ask for the transfer. So they will give you the piece of paper uh, it's, it's really long and every day it's it has different color. This transfer will give you uh, like one hour or one hour and a half depends on by the way by the hour by the day and by the location if you if it's you're going like far far away like 40 minutes by bus uh, or where it's not very popular uh, so you can get a two hours um, transfer but it is like a rush hour you are traveling um, inside the downtown you will have only one hour uh, transfer so do not forget to take this transfer, as without this transfer you will not be able uh, to take a bus one more time. The bus stops only on the bus stops. And it stops if you are standing closer to the road. If you are standing like far away from the road and you see the bus, uh, it will not stop. Why? Because uh, it means like you are not waiting for the bus. But if you are coming closer to the road or like and the driver understand that you are expecting the bus, uh, so the bus stops. This is also very weird because when I uh, first uh, uh, came to Halifax, I was waving with my hand like, please stop, you know. <laughs> And the bus drivers, they were laughing at me and I didn't understand like why, why? <laughs> but it was good, it was fun. Another, uh, if we're talking about Halifax, you can also expect to take a ferry. But ferry is very limited because there is only two types of ferry and the ferry can take you only uh, to the Dartmoor. So there is connection like Halifax, Dartmouth and that's it. The price for, uh, for it, it's also the same. I would definitely recommend you just to try to take a ferry. I, I was taking it sometimes just to have like, you know, this uh, sea journey. Uh, so yeah, this is fun. Uh, in Halifax, we have only one uh, airport. 
If you are taking a bus to airport, it usually takes you 40 minutes. From downtown, um, it's a little bit more expensive than the regular price. Oh, by the way, uh, you can also buy a ticket in the bus itself, but only if you have a certain amount of coins, because they will not give you any change. Uh, another way how you can commute between different cities, if you, if for example, you decided to take a trip to the ocean uh, because we have a lot of uh, beautiful beaches and trails all over across the Halifax or Nova Scotia or you want to take a, a, a trip to another city this will be almost impossible there is a bus uh, the company called maritime bus uh, but um, it's a very very poor connection because uh, there could be only one bus in the day uh, and it's not very convenient so what i will definitely suggest you if you have a big family and if you are going to commute to the work or to take your uh, kids to school or you want even to go to the costco grocery or uh, to ikea you will definitely need a car because uh, like waiting for the bus for one hour then to take this bus uh, and it will stop you every uh, two minutes and the, the whole process is just not worth it because it, it is too way long. You can spend like a day for traveling like from Halifax to Bedford, from Bedford to Dartmouth, if you, of course, if you need this. But if you are locating in downtown, there is everywhere is the bus stop and the grocery is just in front of your apartment so maybe it's not a huge need but you will not be able to go to the beach for example or you will not be uh, able to go to the um, trail you will be very limited in uh, your activities so i would definitely suggest you to think about uh, buying a car or renting a car this is also a very good option uh, to rent a car for a whole like for the weekend for the long weekend but please mind if there is a long weekend long weekend it means like friday saturday sunday please book ahead like months uh, or a couple of weeks or even faster because it will be overbooked and you can have a good uh, prices for renting a car like $30 per um, day or depends on the size of the car and up to 50 something like that and there is also uh, a train nobody using a train I don't have any friends that used a train or a bus uh, like if we're talking about commuting to other cities so it's not popular at all um, yeah so like everyone has a car or using a bus and that's it uh, friends uh, I, I thought this video will be shorter but I realized that I have a lot of information to share so uh, thanks for watching do not forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video please comment if you have any other questions and if you would like me to discuss some other topics just let me know so see you soon guys bye